I'm going to be showing you guys how to improve at Ozu and some other rhythm games. So basically, I've been playing rhythm games for about two years now, and I've been... and I'm actually doing pretty good. So, the first... Th even if you have, like, a really bad keyboard, it might slow you down, like, a little bit, like... a laptop keys, like what Silly Fangirl said, who used laptop keys for a year, and then just started getting some keyboards. Some other types of keyboards, and then he just basically got better. So my so the one main thing I want to talk about is increasing stamina. This is for Ozu Mania, Funky Friday, or just any rhythm game. So what I do, I increase stamina. You just gotta tap light if you're not doing something very hard. See how I'm tapping light like that? I used to tap hard all the time. I used to tap hard all the time. I did use to tap hard all the time though, but I figured out that was losing out. I was losing stamina by doing that, so. Yeah. And also the tensor. Don't tense up. You see how light I'm tapping? This could increase your stamina. This could make it easier to, like, trill if you're tapping light like this. Now, basically, if you want to be good like me and improve super fast, I would recommend getting this Apex Pro keyboard because it help, will help you out a whole lot. So what I do is I tap light like this. Yeah. It's something hard. Then I tap pretty hard, like chord jacks. Like, like the harder I tap, like the more, the more harder the song is, or the beat map, the more harder I tap. Just to make it clear. basically what I do. I would recommend getting this keyboard if you want to increase your stamina, though. Because also, Kane Mining, the number one player in the world, also uses an Apex Pro keyboard. See how the, this is in mini jack patterns that I do? I just... So what you've got to do is like, 
try playing any hard maps that are like your skill level and improve and then just keep going up and that's how I I improve and that's how I improve so yeah if you're doing card jacks and attack like this Now the main thing I want to focus on is Vibro, because that tends to like reduce a lots of stamina, but I'm used to it already because I've been playing Vibro minigames for like many years, like those Mario Party 9 minigames. I'd recommend tensing up your muscles and try to like maybe tap hard as possible and then vibro i was able to get to like 63 but i got a new laptop that's why it says 60 right there but anyway that's going to be the end of this video please make sure to like and subscribe if you want to see more from me and i will see you next time